routines, and habits. 80% of what we do is on automatic pilot. Routines and habits allow us to free our mental capacity to deal with new things. However, we need to check those habits from time to time to verify whether it is still serving us right. When you want to engage in any kind of change, you need to start with the environment and start replacing old habits with new ones. If you do not put the new disciplines in place and create a helping environment, chances are you will remain under the inertia of established habits and change will not be enacted. If you have taken the decision to stop smoking or lose weight or practice your musical instrument, you need first to create an environment that will be conducive to the new behavior and difficult to the old behavior, putting barriers. When you evolve in a smoke-free environment, when you make healthy food available and unhealthy food difficult to get, when you put your musical instrument at arm's length and not in a closet somewhere, you create a favorable environment to enable you to live by your decision. Soon, the new behavior becomes a habit and thus you revert to automatic pilots.